Now I've done part unboxing already because I wanted to find out if I need to get accessories, what I need to order. So I've partly opened this. I haven't opened the drone, but I've opened the um, goggles and the controller. I not own this yet at all, of course, because this is just the unboxing part. So let's open these up. What do we have in this box? Oh, in this box here, we have the power supply for uh, the goggles. And then we have the battery for the drone. And it's fully charged and a mount this is where you would charge the battery up on this here the the batteries are weird compared to my Mavic Pro it has this little connector I guess it's, it's got wires in it but it could me it to me it could break off this plugs in here in the uh, power supply unit just sits there you plug USB-C in here and uh, into a power supply and you charge up the battery up in here. Oh, the controller. The controller. Never used this before. I always use <clears throat> throttle. All right. Ah, the goggles. The goggles. <clears throat> this is the newer goggles, not the old ones. Oops. Oh, a couple extra. A couple of um, extra propellers. And, oh wow. The drone. Look at the size of this thing. Tiny. I think it's still over the 250 limit. Sorry about the noise, guys. Oh, hey. Look at this. Oh, downward pointing props. Very cool. Oh, here's the sensors. Now it only has bottom sensors so that it can uh, sense the bottom. It doesn't have forward sensing, side, back, anything else. You've got to charge the battery for the drone. You've got to charge the controller and you've got to charge the power pack for the goggles. All right, guys, I guess it's a first time for everything. This is it. The drone's out here, you can see that. I'm using the motion controller and how you use this is you go up you go down left right turn never done this before I don't even know how to start the thing I've had it on I've got it um, everything's bound and uh, linked together but I've never flown it so I don't even know how to actually get it started so let's turn everything on. Let's turn the goggles on. All right, goggles and drone are on. All we got to do is turn the controller on okay oh there we're ready to go let's see what we can see in the goggles here all right and this the goggles have a touch pad on the side that says enhanced warning uh, 
zone nearby, fly with caution. The Schlinkers, um, let's just hit OK. And what does it tell me down here? Aircraft in low power state. I don't know why. Double press the lock button to start the drone, to start the motors. Now the lock button, if I don't get in the way of what's going on here, I can't tell where I'm at. Okay. Oh, what do you know? Motor started. Press the, and hold the lock. Whoa! Stop, record, start. Hmm. I hit those buttons when I wasn't supposed to. Okay, let me just see what we got here for mode. Oh, that's record. I'm stopping and starting record. <laughs> I have a landing pad, a takeoff and landing pad, I guess I'm going to have to use. That should be off. We'll turn the controller off. And we'll turn the goggles off. Well guys, my first impression of the DJI Avada. <laughs> Make sure I don't get in the dust. And the, they're downward facing uh, props. So you can't land like this like some guys do with the, with the minis, but you can bring it down and grab it from the top and turn it sideways and it'll shut off. And then the uh, controller. Now this is an experience. This I like. Uh, throttle, power on, brake button, big brake button. So if you push that, you can out automatically stop. It seems that when you let go of the throttle, it stops anyway. But I guess if you got full throttle and then you just hit the brake, it's gonna stop. Ah, uh, lock. I'm not, that starts and stops it. The motors. Uh, I don't know what else it does. And then this is the mode. Right now it's normal mode and sport mode, but you can go into a third mode. And they say they're preventing that right now for the first time. You have to do some settings in order to get that to do the... Then you can do flips and, and all kinds of things. The drone itself has something called turtle mode. Now turtle mode, if you if it lands in the in a tree, well not in a tree, if it lands in the grass or something and it's upside down, it will flip itself over so that you could take off again. You know, if you can't find it in the grass or something, or uh, if it's too far away to go walk to get it, if it, it'll flip over and then hopefully you can uh, it'll you can take off again. But I really like this uh, coming from just your regular DJI Mavic Pro. Uh, drone to this kind of drone is a really step different but it, it sure uh, it sure flies nice great experience first time and uh, we're gonna put this on the um, unboxing and we'll put it all together all right guys thanks for coming out we'll talk to you later guys I gotta go for a shower <laughs> catch you guys later
All right, guys, first flight, first impression, great, love it. When you're not an FPV drone flyer, uh, this is perfect for beginners. Um, everything worked just exactly the way it should have. The only thing I'm not uh, liking too much is the time to um, charge the battery, four hours. Anyways, thanks for coming out, guys. Thanks for watching. And stay tuned for more video from the DJI Avada. We'll catch you guys all on the next one. Stay tuned.